Okay, so uh, I just wanted to do a quick video to show off what uh, what I'm doing on my Nintendo 3DS that I just got. So I got this program that allows me to essentially stream my screens to my computer so that I can capture them. Uh, so this is much better of an approach than trying to film my screens and worry about glares and that kind of crap. So uh, I just wanted to do a quick test video to see what the frame rate will look like or the quality of the video once I've uploaded it to YouTube. So this video is not really about anything other than I'm not going to be doing a gameplay or, you know, really doing anything like that. I'm just uh, seeing how the movement looks, um, like when I pick up these plants, if, you know, paired to the screen I'm actually looking at. Uh, it is a little bit, um, from what I can tell, uh, from the output that I'm seeing on my computer monitor, it looks a little bit slower, but it looks halfway decent. I'm actually pretty impressed uh, for a wireless software capture solution. It's, uh, I think it's not bad. Uh, the hard part, and I part I still can't figure out is how to, uh, or if I want to, I actually took this picture of the DS for the overlay, um, but as you can see, the top screen and actually even the bottom screen are, you know, kind of trapezoidal shape, and the screens don't fit there if I want to keep the same proportions. So I may transform the video, but I also may try to get a new picture for the overlay that's more square lined up, or I might not even do anything, whatever. But anyways, yeah, so I am working on a video to hopefully do a tutorial on how you can do this yourself. Uh, this is the cartridge I used um, uh, to help me get the hack started. Uh, this is a flash cart. Um, I did an unboxing the other day. It's the R4i SDHC Pro Gold 3DS. I don't know. It's uh, got a fancy name, but anyways, uh, the capture looks good. I'm still working on a way that I'm going to capture the audio. I'm still kind of worried about it because I've gotten two strikes from Nintendo. Well, not strikes, but copyright complaints for using their music and their game footage, so I'm not exactly sure what the rules are on game streaming yet but once I figure it out I'm gonna try to do a little bit more gaming um, goodbye